Our story is taken from the book of Exodus. The word Exodus comes from the Greek word departure. This is a story of how God, through a man named Moses, delivered the Israelites from Egyptian slavery. that flood in my land. They talk too much of their God. They eat all our grain. They can raise an army that fights against us. It's time we put them to hard work so they know that we're in charge. I want to get rid of every Hebrew boy. From that day on, Pharaoh mistreated the Israelites and commanded that every Hebrew boy be taken from his family and thrown into the Nile River. end. Even though the Hebrews lived in fear and trembling, they prayed to God and trusted in Him. <laughs> Blessed are you, Lord our God. You sanctify us how will we keep him safe? I don't know, but don't worry. God will help us find a way. With God, my child, He has great plans for you. God will always keep you safe, always. Put baby Moses in the basket, covered him, and placed the basket at the edge of the river. Don't worry, Mother. I'll make sure he's safe. Iron followed baby Moses to see what would happen to him. Meanwhile, Pharaoh's daughter came with her servants. Look, Your Highness, there's a basket floating. You, Hebrew girl, bring it to me. <gasps> it's one of the Hebrew boys. <laughs> Excuse me, princess. Would you like me to ask an Israelite woman to take care of the baby for you? Yes, that would be a wonderful idea. So Moses' sister Miriam went and got her mother, and Moses' own mother took care of him until he was old enough to live in Pharaoh's house. His name will be Moses. I have delivered him from the water. My father will never take him. He is my son now.
Moses, Moses. Here I am. I am God of your father, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. I have seen the suffering of my people and will rescue them out of Egypt. I will bring them to the land I promised your fathers. I am sending you to Pharaoh so you can lead my people out of Egypt. Both the people ask who sent me. What name will I tell them? Tell them I am who am. Tell them the God of their ancestors, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob was sent to you. When I show my power in Egypt, Pharaoh will let them go. I will be with you. Have you seen Moses' staff? They say it's the staff of God. He can do big miracles with it. Maybe Pharaoh will finally listen and let us go. What's the meaning of this? The God of Israel has sent me to you. Let his people go, so they may worship him and end the wilderness. Hmm, I don't know about that. God appearing to you? I'm the real Lord of Egypt. Do you even have a real God? I'll show you. A magician can do that trick. I still won't let your people go. Get away from me, Mose. Just go away. Take your people and go. Pharaoh was still angry and sent armies to capture the Hebrews back.
the sea. Days will come when I will establish a new covenant with the house of Israel. I will put my laws into their minds and write them on their hearts. And I will be their God and they shall be my people. We were moving mountains long before we 